So here we are at the Unhinged Scientist's Lair, and it's time for another day of experimentation. And uh, nothing speaks to mad scientists, I mean unhinged scientists. Mad is a prejudicial word. Nothing speaks to us unhinged scientists like uh, lava. I've killed myself with lava a number of times, and, uh, you know, now's the time to try to understand what it, what it does. So, one experiment that's going on over here is just having lava in uh, glass and surrounding it with some cubes of wool, which should ignite. Um, I'll be interested to see if this works or not. Basically, I'm just going to let this cook for a while and see if any of these guys catch on fire. If none of them catch on fire, then somehow the glass is actually stopping the lava, because the lava really should catch these guys on fire. But uh, we'll just let that cook. In the meantime, though, it's time for some destruction testing. So here we have a plate a half step, uh, a stair step, and a sign with lava. And I have no idea which, if any, will catch on fire, but soon we'll find out. Hey, wow, maybe it's none will catch on fire. That's actually pretty interesting, because wood will definitely catch on fire. So, anyway, that's step one. I'm going to go through a number of other experiments here. I won't show you all the setup, but uh, you'll just see them one after the other. Okay, here's the next experiment. It's getting dark, but that's okay. So we have reeds, cacti, wheat, that's just barely started, and a mushroom. Okay, the mushroom got wiped out. The wheat got wiped out. Aha! The uh, reeds got wiped out. But the cacti, no problem. Okay, next experiment is railroad track, fence post, ladder, and I've also put a ladder in there, just to see, and a flower. Kinda don't think the flower's gonna make it. Okay, rail got wiped out, flower got wiped out. Fence post, no problem, and uh, ladder indeed holds back the lava. Cool. Okay, next experiment, we have a bookshelf, a painting, a door, and a torch. Torch is wiped out. Door is not wiped out. Painting is not wiped out. Huh, and bookshelf. Alright, so just the torch. Okay, here we have bed, lever, note block, and just a plank, you know, block of wood, just because I want to see something burn. So here we go. block of wood will not burn? Oh my gosh, that's bizarre. <laughs> so I wanted to verify that a block of wood would not actually burn, and that seems to be the case, which is pretty bizarre. Okay, last experiment. Cake, pumpkin, snow, piece of wool behind it, I figure the snow's gonna melt, and a uh, log. The snow doesn't melt. Wow! <laughs> That's pretty wild. And here, just because we want to see something burn, I'm going to put cake and uh, wool. What? <laughs> wool doesn't burn? Okay. So after a few days, uh, the wool is still here. The glass seems to have stopped the lava from doing anything. Just to show the lava can do things next to wool some wool here, and I suspect we'll see in a second or two. That one's certainly going to take off pretty quick, and probably that one too. So I decided to rerun this experiment on time-lapse, so I'm going to put blocks at 4 away, 3 away, 2 away, and 1 away, and then sit here and watch what happens. So what happens is the uh, ones that are one away and two away, they burn. The ones that are three away don't, and four. Here's another little experiment where next to the lava source I put a uh, four different things. Ice, pumpkin, bread, bed, and uh, stairs, and none of them catch fire after a full day. Okay, so what have we learned from all this? Well, first of all, 
that almost all blocks can stop lava flow, at least for a little while. Um, so lava can set things on fire like flowers and so on that are in the way. But, uh, but basically even things like wool blocks and wood can stop lava temporarily. However, if, if wool blocks or wood sit next to lava for a while, it'll get, they'll catch on fire. And the, uh, the distance seems to be about three meters away that they'll catch on fire. Um, the things that actually burn are just wool and wood, and that's it. And not even wood stairs or wood, you know, these half steps, they don't burn at all. And, uh, you know, grass will burn just very temporarily. Uh, tree foliage will burn, obviously. Um, but anyway, that's, that's about it.